Pension a punch for the first day of the month. Welcome to Rush Faster's August Carry Roundup, the series where we take a look at what's happening in the wonderful world of carry. There's a lot of new stuff to talk about. We've got Evergoods, we've got Alpha 1.9, we've got Bellroy, Tom Bin, Heim Planet, Triple Ort Design, and we'll be giving away a cool gift pack from our friends at Nomad to one lucky subscriber. We'll also draw the winners of our Black Ember Compact giveaway. So let's stop messing about and get into it. But first, Hello, my name is Roland from Rush Faster, and at Rush Faster, we do guides and walkthroughs, bringing you better gear and better ways to carry. If you want more of us in your life, like, subscribe, and subscribe to our newsletter as well. The link to that is below. Delivery. Probably more cool packs. Okay, let's draw the winner of last month's giveaway. Tiger Blaze. Congratulations, you have won the compact from Black Ember. We'll get that to you out in the post as soon as possible. Okay, let's start with Alpha 1.9er who have collaborated with Bowgear on the Camel 2.0. And from what we've seen, it looks to be a nice mix of the two brands. Alpha 1.9er originally teased the collaboration on a July 4th Instagram post. However, that post was followed up on July 18th with another post announcing that it had been delayed due to a request to revise a part of the pack. Helm of Alpha 1.9er said they can't sign off on a drop when the pack is not 100% ready for production. They hope to have an update for us soon, but good on Alpha 1.9er for not going ahead with the pack until they get things just right. We'll keep you up to date as we find out more. Staying in the tactical world for a moment longer, Triple Ort Design, or TAD, have announced the launch of the Fast Pack Lightspeed Sterile. The Sterile, which is an interesting naming choice, is a clean version of their popular Lightspeed pack. It's cleaner with less molly, and the removal of the paracord expansion. There's no front zipper compartment. It's got updated and more ergonomic shoulder straps and a redesigned back panel, which should offer more airflow and comfort. And these changes have all come from customer feedback, which is always great to see. As well as the announcement of the sterile, Triple Ort Design have also created the Armory, which allows you to build your own fast pack light speed. And there's a whole bunch of great options, different colors, different attachments, different bits and pieces. You have a play around, it's really fun. It'll take about eight weeks to get you your custom pack but I'm sure it will be worth the wait. Now, if funky colors are your thing, you should check out the new Deep Plum colorway from Bellroy. The company have applied their latest premium lifestyle colorway to their classic backpack, Tokyo Tote Pack Sling and Sling Mini. It's a beautiful, rich color, and I can see it as a nice option for people who want to have a bit of fun, but still look professional. And that's kind of Bellroy's whole thing in a nutshell. They've also recently released their Tech Briefcase, which is 14 liters and can hold up to a 16 inch laptop. It comes with a detachable padded shoulder strap, water resistant main zipper, luggage pass through, and it's made of their leather free construction. Bellroy designer Aaron says the tech briefcase design focused on creating functional sophistication. It's a bag that stands out on the commute and blends in at the office. Now I do love a good tech briefcase, so I can't wait to get this into the studio and check it out. Let me know in the comments if there's anything in particular that you want to know about it. And while you're down there in the comments, you can enter this month's giveaway from our friends at Nomad. To celebrate the release of their new pen, we've teamed up with Nomad to give away said pen. The Nomad pen is machined from a solid metal body featuring a smooth click button mechanism and reliable Schmidt EasyFlow 9000 ink cartridge. It's a very nice pen, but that's not all we're giving away. Nomad will also send the winner the Hallween Leather Nomad and Orbit Key Key Organizer, which we talked about in the last Carry Roundup video, and this sleek card wallet, which is also made using Hallween Leather. This is a nice little EDC pack, and all you have to do to enter is subscribe to our channel, subscribe to our newsletter, and leave a comment on this video. Entries close August 26th, and we'll choose a one lucky winner at random, and we'll announce it in the September Roundup video. Anyway, I do actually have all of these products here, so I'm gonna quickly show you them. So we've got the pen. Oh yes. Oh, that's very nice. We've got the key organizer in Halloween leather. Don't worry, these aren't the ones we're sending out to the winner. Oh. Mmm. Mmm. And the card wallet. Ooh. Little pouch. Oh yes. It's a good prize. Thanks, Nomad. Right, moving on. Now, Evergoods, who are in a bit of a purple patch at the moment, have just released the Civic Access Sling. The Civic Access Sling is a compact, streamlined, breathable, all day, all round town sling, but it can also be worn as a waste pack. It's made with Evergoods new solution dyed balanced ballistic nylon and features YKK number 10 and number eight zippers with a DWR finish. It definitely looks like an Evergoods product, which is a good thing. It's a nice size and it should keep all your EDC items out of your pocket. I think it's gonna be a very popular choice for sling heads and I'm digging this new material that they've, that they've been using. Looks really, really nice. Now, if you need a bit more space than a sling, you might be interested in Tom Bin's new tote, the Cambiata. 
a tote pack backpack hybrid with tuckable shoulder straps and a fully removable shoulder strap. There's been a long wait for Tom Bin to release an EDC tote and they've finally gone done it. And it's typically Tom Bin with lots of thoughtful organization, interesting colors and materials, and a look that is sure to be divisive. It's 21 liters and features five external pockets, four internal pockets, piping all around the bag to help it stand up on its own, even when it's empty, and lots of O-rings. I'm keen to hear what you think of the Cambiata. It's an interesting one. Is it a tote or is it a backpack? Would you use it? Let me know in the comments. The Cambiata from Tom Bin is currently available for pre-order and is expected to ship in September. Something that you can purchase at the moment are two new packs from Heim Planet out of their Motion series. Packs in the Motion series are lightweight and designed for outdoor activities. The new packs come in a 20 litre version called the Arc and a 25 litre version called the Ellipse. Both feature a removable hip belt, laptop sleeve, water resistant YKK zippers, a hip belt with pockets, and it's made using ultra light dyer shell. The large expandable front compartment means that even when the backpack is fully loaded, additional gear can be stored in the expandable compartment. It comes in light gray and dark gray. Ooh, look at that sweater. Beautiful. Love a good piece of knitwear. Moment have teamed up with travel adventure photographer filmmaker Emmett Sparling to create a camera bag that they're calling the Day Chaser. Emmett and Moment claim that the 35 litre pack brings together the best of military grade performance, camera bag technology and travel packs. Its modularity allows for various configurations of camera equipment and personal items. Now there aren't a lot of nice looking camera bags out there and I think this one looks good. It's currently available on Kickstarter and is expected to ship in January. Finally, Bitplay have sent us a few items from the Aquaseal series. Let me get them. These are, these are waterproof IPX7 bags that can survive under a meter of water for up to 30 minutes. So uh, yeah, you can, you can put stuff in that you want to keep dry. And there's even like uh, pouches to put your phone in. And then you can still use, you can still use the touch screen. So, you know, good for people who want to have a bath and scroll TikTok, I suppose. These are all completely modular and they're, uh, they're attached with magnetic fidlock buckles. So you can set it up however you want it. It's, it's sort of made for camping, I suppose, or outdoor activities, but they're cool little pouches and they've got a nice sort of street. I sort of say street for anything that's like kind of black and tactical, but not too military, but it's got that sort of vibe. Um, I haven't tested these out, but you know, I like them. They're sort of, they feel like they're well-made. Cordura, water repellent Cordura. Some nice padding. They look cool. Thanks, Bitplay. Okay, that's probably enough from me. I hope you found this video useful. I'll leave details of everything that I've mentioned in the video description below. We'll be back on September 1 with the next installment of the Carry Roundup. But uh, in the meantime, we'll have plenty of great carry content coming at you, so make sure you're subscribed. But until the next one, I'm Roland from Rush Faster, and this has been the August Carry Roundup. Take care.